Welcome to Metal Gods TV with Mick the Beard. Hi, with Mick the Beard from Metal Gods TV. I'm here at Bloodstock and I'm here with 1349. Hi, guys. Hello. Hello. How are you enjoying the Bloodstock Festival at the moment? It's been quite good so far. It's uh, been an awesome crowd out here and. Uh, we played Brutal Assault actually this morning, so we went off stage at uh, 2 o'clock and we uh, flew directly here in order to make the show, so it's been uh, quite a hectic day, but uh, coming here and play for this crowd, it's uh, make it all worthwhile. So. And it's, is, is it sort of a, re a long time since you've been to the UK? It's uh, 2007, yeah, I think, yeah. No, 2007 was the last, uh, we did a small headline tour here in 2007. And, uh, the UK is not uh, spoiled with uh, big festivals like they are in Germany, so uh, it's, uh, it's really good to come back and uh, luckily we are coming back uh, in October as well to do a headline tour, so uh, we'll see a lot more of the UK then and we're really, really looking forward to that. And you it seem was really great to see that we still have the following here, yeah. that, we, uh, that we still have a certain grip on the UK. Uh, they haven't forgotten about us, it no, seems, so that's, it's, uh, that's what I was going to say next. I say you seem to have a really good fan base in the UK. Yeah, they're very loyal. I mean, they've always been with us. We had several good shows. I particularly remember from the, the extensive European tour we had in 2005. We had several shows in the UK, and Nottingham was one of the highlights of the shows because the crowd was fantastic. And uh, and it's been really good you, overall in the UK when we've been there. The Underworld last time we played London as oh, well yeah, was yeah. fantastic. We had almost packed yeah. place. And would you say that the UK is the place you get the best reception from the audience? Well, it's it's uh, yeah. it's a tie. It's yeah. it's it's always hard to tell because uh, every night when you walk on stage and uh, you get a good reception, it's like it's hard to compare with. Uh, what country you've been in a tour ago or whatever, you know, so it's uh, it's always hard to remember or be objective about the whole thing, but we we always been lucky to have a good following in the UK, and of course we were signed to a UK label for many years as well, and I reckon that counts for something, it's kind of, uh, actually to play here at Bloodstock today, it felt a little bit to come back to old turf, you know, to be in a little bit of feeling of coming home, and that's uh, that's really it was really a good feeling playing tonight with a crowd out there and everything and uh, see some uh, ugly British faces again. It's, uh, it's really a good feeling. We also have still cooperative partners here in the UK, yeah. Factory Music, which is our booking agent. And of course, does we, still have, uh, we still have a lot to do with Candlelight Records as well, you know, so it's with a back catalog and everything. So it's so we, tie, we have ties to the UK as per today as well and. Uh, and we're very happy with, with the situation that uh, the band has, has got for now. Yeah. It's uh, very good, it's very positive. It's uh, ready for more, more work. Yeah. The band has got more potential, for sure. And uh, in 2012, you most likely will see a new effort from us. Oh, great, new album then, yeah? Oh, yeah. yeah. Is that any working title yet, or is it just... Uh... No, nothing come as far as that. Nothing to reveal yet. Nothing to reveal. We call you when we know. <laughs> all will be revealed in good time. <laughs> and uh, all the festivals you've done so far, I mean, is there any big highlight that stands out for you? Yesterday was good. Yeah? Yesterday was really, really good, yeah. I have to agree with Arkeon. Yeah, definitely. And, uh, it, it, it's all, of course, it's amazing. Um, uh, here we play, uh, it's, it's daylight uh, when we perform. Uh, yesterday we played at uh, one o'clock uh, and uh, it's complete darkness and you still see the crowd still going, but playing through all day and still see it, all that energy. It's, uh, it's, uh, and of course, the music that we perform is, uh, is best enjoyed in darkness anyhow, you know, so it's, it's just uh, the opposite. But uh, I think that we proved today that we can, uh, we can put it off in... Uh, a somber daylight as well, and uh, we will still create uh, a true darkness. We bring the darkness. <laughs> you bring the darkness. <laughs> and uh, finally, have you got a message you would like to give to the UK people? Definitely. Hope to see you on tour in uh, October. Please come out and uh, rage with us. Check your local press for these guys where they're touring. Okay. 
www.legion349.com or our Facebook, MySpace page. Or Twitter. Twitter. Do you guys do all that yourselves, Twitter and the Facebook? We have some, some people to help us, but yeah, mainly we, we control everything ourselves. We are a very good rooted band, which like to have control, who likes to have control over everything ourselves, because it's basically it's we that runs this. We run this, no one else. And we want, we to a certain extent, we find it good to be that way, you know? Yeah. We can have cooperative partners, but we'd like to be involved to the bottom line ourselves. That's right. so we'd like to be in charge. <laughs> Great. Guys, thanks a lot. Thank you so nice much. Nice to talk to you. Brilliant, guys.